welcome to this video. Today I'm going to be doing something that I haven't done in a while and I'm going to be doing an initial hair review. So I've got some bundles of hair that I'm going to be reviewing from the Raw Virgin Hair Boutique and I've got four bundles and a silk based closure. I'm going to be doing an initial review just on the texture, the smell, shipping. So without further ado, let's just get right into it. So here is the box that I have from the Raw Virgin Hair Boutique. If you guys have seen the last review that I did for them, this is the same packaging that they used the last time. So obviously their packaging and their branding is consistent. It was tied with this ribbon, this black ribbon here. Got their logo as well as their website and just a little bit of information about what they provide. Okay. So inside the box are the bundles and the closure. I'm just gonna take them all out one by one. The silk base closure was in this packet, but I've also taken that out as well. So this is their Malaysian wavy hair, and it is four bundles of 22 inches, and the closure that I have is 16 inch. And the closure is a silk base closure, and I'm gonna get to that last. I'm just gonna open up a bundle, smell it, see what it's like, and then I'm gonna do the same thing for the rest of them. So all of them are individually wrapped in their own packet. It's labeled 22 inches up here and they're all pretty much labeled that same way as well with just a pen. It's really quite curled. It's different to what usual body wave hair comes like, which is not a problem. It's quite curly, so I, to me, this gives me the impression that when I actually install the hair, I'm not gonna have to do much curling to it. I'm not sure if this is the natural state, but I do like these curls. They're like nice and bouncy curls. This is 22 inches, yeah, stretched out it seems about right to be honest. The hair feels quite soft. It smells like nice, like it's been fragranced. Yeah, I like, I like how it feels so far. It has been wrapped with this rubber band up at the top here, which isn't good for hair because hair tends to snag on rubber bands and start to break off they obviously have their reasons as to why that has been used yeah it's a, like a nice light brown color and that's another thing that i really liked about the straight hair that i reviewed for them before the hair color was absolutely beautiful especially when the light hit it second bundle is pretty much the same feels even softer the wave pattern is slightly different this side of it is a bit more wavier whereas the ends are curly it's a bit different to the first one that i just held up It smells like fragranced again, almost like it's been sprayed with something. It does smell quite nice. There is a little bit of like a storage smell in here again, but that is something that like maybe like a soak or a co-wash would kind of get out. The texture is the same as the last one. Third bundle again. Feels just as soft. The curls are just as bouncy. Doesn't smell too bad. Has the same smell as the last one. It seems quite consistent so far with their bundles, um, to be honest. And the last one. Yeah, kind of the same. The texture feels exactly the same. This one also is quite wavy at the top and curlier at the bottom. It smells this one probably smells the best out of all of them. Not saying they smell bad, but there is a like a smell in them. It's not a bad smell, but there is a smell. Um, if you don't like the smell, it's something that you can like get out with a soak and a co-wash. This was the one that's like the least fragrant out of all of them. This one just smells pretty normal to me. This is meant to be body wave, but they look a bit more like loose wave. Um, this is kind of how loose wave comes but this one in particular does look like it still has its sort of body wave texture to it. Um, it's not gonna be a problem because I usually style my hair myself. So once I've installed it, I tend to either curl it up or do whatever I need to do to it. So this wouldn't be a problem. I would like to see what it is like installed with them prior to me styling it. So if I do like what what these curls look like once they're installed, I will keep it and then I will obviously film the review with that. But if not, I will just end up taking a picture and then showing you guys in the video how this curl pattern comes out. The wefts also look pretty good. They look like a good amount for 22 inches. 
they look well done and very strong actually yeah the bundles yeah the weft they look pretty good if you ask me and the color again i'm sure you guys can see the color as the light's hitting it that is one thing i love about their hair they always have like the best brown color in their their weave it's more of a natural brown which is what i like to see in hair i'm going to move on to the closure and this is actually a silk based closure baby hairs here that you could cut down oh and this back bit is the lace and then inside the hair is the silk base with silk base closures there's a layer of silk and then, and then there's about two layers of lace underneath that silk so all you see is the top layer of silk the hairs are then attached to the lace which is below the silk so you don't see the beads of the hair on the closure basically so you know those little tiny black dots that you usually see on closures or brown dots depends on the color of the closure or if you bleach or not so the little black dots that you usually see on the closures you don't get to see that with the silk base because it's hidden below the layer of silk it's underneath here rather than you being able to see it through the silk itself it feels really really soft it has a nice like a thick texture to it it ha has no not a single scent in that whatsoever it just smells like ordinary hair yeah it smells it smells very good actually i love silk base closures if i had a choice i would definitely go with silk base rather than lace because i feel like the fact that the silk gives so much more of a realistic look rather than a lace closure and i feel like silk base are a lot more stronger in terms of the hair and how long it lasts on the closure itself because with lace if you pull and you the more you use your lace closure and the more you pull at it and the more you sew it down and stuff like that it starts to stretch out and eventually it loses its shape so it becomes very slack and then with that the hair starts to come off it as well because obviously they're no longer attached to the lace as it's been pulled and pulled and pulled and so on and so forth but silk based closures they tend to be a lot stronger and they last a lot longer in my opinion anyway so i'm going to definitely be installing this as soon as possible by the time this video has gone up it's probably installed already so make sure you follow me on instagram on snapchat just so you can keep up and see what i kind of do with the wig i don't think i'm going to be doing anything special to it i think i'm just going to be making something quite basic because i really do like the texture of their the previous hair that i've used from this company i didn't want to do anything to that one because it's just the hair is absolutely amazing so if that's anything to go by i do think i will be having a great time with this one and i think i'm just going to love it as much as i do the last hair that i've tried with them if you have any questions just drop them in the comment section below all the details for the raw virgin hair boutique is going to be in the description box as well so do check that out make sure you check out their instagram and their website so you can see other types of hair that they do offer i hope to see you guys in my next video please don't forget to subscribe and thumbs up this video and i will be seeing you guys next time thank you so much for watching bye